Hey YouTube and fellow collectors, OTK back, and in today's video, we're going to go over 3R's Eric Raider. Alright, so let's get into it. First thing, box. Really sweet box. We got a half box, which I really like the half box. Save on room. I don't know if you guys that keep your boxes. Me, I keep all the boxes, all my figures. So, uh, really nice box. Take a look. No pictures of the figure on the box. But it is magnetic, you know, and you get your slip cover. Here, a nice battleship. Looks like uh, maybe the Bismarck. You guys let me know if you know. Put that back there. And then uh, here we go. Here's a nice picture of the figure. Nice slip cover here. Looks real nice. And always, you got some instructions. How to remove the head, the hands, all that, and then instructional videos and do other things there. It looks like hanging the sword and dagger. But you got that. It's really nice. Alright, foam inlay. That out, and here he is. Good old Eric Raider. Looks like we got the bag that has all of his insignias and everything, so it's always fun putting that stuff in. Let's go. Let's give her the ribbon. Here, you take the ribbon. Here, the ribbon's all yours. All right. Let's take a look at the figure, you guys. Here we go. We got Grand Admiral Eric Raider. Very nice. Very happy. Always happy with new 3R figures. All right. So let's see what else we got in this box. We've got, here's his dagger. Really nice. Everything's always real metal too. This dagger. Ceremonial knife, right? That sword. Here we got his baton, which is really sweet. I love the yellow. Looks like we've got uh, two caps. White cap, blue cap. I have to put the insignias on. Looks like in the older figures we didn't have to do stuff like that, but as soon as the newer figures are coming out, we have to put all the insignias on. It seems like shoulder boards and all these insignias, which is fine. That's what we need to do, right? His ribbon bar. Metals. Looks like these are to hang the sword and dagger from his belt, looks like. Cool. Looks like they've got lion's heads on them. Cool. I need to focus on that. But those are really cool. Got that. Alright, let's see what's in underneath, right? Here we go. And there it is. So, long coat, which I'm probably gonna put him in. Looks like we get some gray gloves. Watch. Some binoculars. Awesome, right? Cool watch. We got some more hands. Looks like a belt and another belt so whoops all right all right guys so there he is out of the box got Eric Raider and uh, I'll get them all put together and we'll take another look at him right all right Here. and she is really loving that 3R ribbon you know easy entertainment over there so all right guys thanks we will get right back to you All right, guys, back. Got them all together, and in his glory, we have three R's, Eric Raider. And if you guys ask me, definitely, definitely recommend 
picking this guy up. So he is 3R's newest release. We have another Erwin Rommel coming out, Desert Fox. So I'd say, what, Desert Fox 2.0, even though this is going to be our third Rommel. But, uh, yeah, we'll see what comes after that. But, yeah, guys, I highly recommend Eric Rader. Look at that. Yeah, great looking figure. So I had an Eric Raider in my collection. Um, it was a custom kit bash using DID, well it would have been 3R uh, stuff, but uh, we threw together this guy, which at the time, you know, I was like, oh, he's not bad. But uh, yeah, little custom kit bash Eric Raider. So, but, not bad at all, I didn't think, but, you know, compared to 3R. So, yeah, well there it is, guys. Grand Admiral Eric Raider. Like always, guys, keep on collecting, and until next time.